Right now, we're going to send it over to meteorologist Lindsay Rachel. She's at Upstate University Hospital, but with more on what health problems the weather can cause. Lindsay, it's not just the heat, it's also the humidity, right? Exactly right. We've been talking about this all week. We're going to feel the hot, hot heat this weekend, but it's not just the heat. We're going to feel the high humidity too, so that's just going to make matters worse. With the heat, with the humidity, it's going to feel more like over 100 degrees. So maybe you've already made plans for this weekend to stay inside with the air conditioning to keep cool, but if you plan on working outdoors or maybe enjoying the great outdoors with friends and family, you're really going to need to look out for signs of heat exhaustion. And it can sneak up on you sometimes where you're working outside or being someplace warm and then start getting a headache, get lightheaded, get cramps, get nauseous. Um, in extreme cases, you get uh, confused and not yourself. Um, it can make you pretty sick. And heat exhaustion isn't something to be taken lightly. This is going to be one of your best accessories over the next couple of days. Caffeine, alcohol, it's just going to dehydrate you quickly, just like the weather that we're going to be expecting. So be sure to constantly hydrate yourself over the next couple of days. Coming up at 6 o'clock, we'll take you to a hot spot that will keep you cool this weekend. Live in Syracuse, Lindsay Rachel, News Channel 9. Lindsay, good advice. Thank you. And make sure you